police said, quote, you can't make this stuff up. A man arrested for driving drunk in the parking lot of the police station. The man was found driving in a restricted area of the parking lot on Veterans Memorial Drive among several marked police cruisers. New tonight, Eyewitness News reporter Perry Russell joins us now live with more details on the bizarre arrest. Police say the man they arrested failed every sobriety test and his blood alcohol content was five times the legal limit. On the Warwick Police Facebook page, they wrote, you can't make this stuff up. Police tell us they arrested a man from Warwick who they say was driving drunk in the police station's back parking lot this weekend. 41-year-old Richard Fisher from the Oakland Beach part of town was charged with driving under the influence. At the entrance of the parking lot, there are two stop signs, one on each side that read, do not enter, police vehicles only. Police say Fisher went in anyway. As police wrote online, the rear parking lot is full of marked police cars of all shapes and sizes. At around 10 o'clock Saturday night, police say Fisher was driving around the lot when an officer stopped him. Police say Fisher told that officer he was trying to find Coburn Street. So we went looking for Coburn Street and we found it four miles away. Police tell us Fisher failed every sobriety test given to him and his blood alcohol content was five times the legal limit. After they processed Fisher at the station, police tell us he was taken to Kent Hospital to be treated. And we went to Fisher's home to talk to him about what happened. He was there, but will be in court at the beginning of next month. Live in work with the Mobile Newsroom, Perry Russell, Eyewitness News.